Okay, so today we'll be showing you how to install the Atari 2600 on the modded Wii. First, we're going to install the channel. Go to Wii Mod Lite. Press start. Wait for it to load. Go down to the WAD Manager. Press A on the Wii SD slot. Go down to your WADs. And there's the Atari 2600 WAD. So press A to install. A again. Should install very quickly. Press A to continue. And then press Home to go back to the main uh, Wii menu. And you should have the Atari 2600 channel. And there it is. Press A to start it up. Pretty cool little channel. Press start. Should load up very quickly. There it is. Now press A to start the emulator. And there's the games. I've added just five games just to show how it works. So let's go with uh, Pac-Man. Press A. And A again. It starts right up. Now I'm using the Wii Remote. Which works perfectly. So there's the, there you go. Now to exit, press home. To pick another game. Let's go Mario Bros. There you go. Gives a little bit of time to load up. There you go. That's the classic Mario Bros. game. Looks pretty good considering. Now to exit out of the emulator, you press uh, home and then home again. It should take you right back to the Wii menu. And there you go. This is probably the only Atari system I'm going to be putting in my series. If anything changes in the future, I I will add more videos for, uh, for it. But for right now, I'm only doing Atari 2600. Now let's go over to the PC and I will show you how to set up your SD card to play Atari 2600 games. Okay, now over on the PC, I'm going to leave you two links in the description. One will be for the channel WAD, and the other one will be for the emulator itself under the webrew.org. So you go over to the download links, click download, then you go over to this uh, media fire uh, folder and you just download the wad for the channel and then I'll show you what the SD card should look like so here's my SD with the apps Wii 2600 em emulator all the files inside the Wii Mod Lite for the channel the wads folder for the channel for Atari 2600 and the Wii 2600 folder, which will have the ROMs folder, 
And this is the format the ROM's got to be in. They got to end with the A26. So I got five here. And that's pretty much it. If you have any questions or comments, uh, put them down below. And on to the next video.